What up YouTube, back at you guys with another story. This one is absolutely ridiculous. It's another video that makes me wish that idiots did not have, ignorant idiots did not have access to the internet. This video is about the Indiana student uh, named Sam Hendrickson making a video called Why I Hate to be Asian. The link to that video is actually going to be in the description box below so you can watch the video and then come back and let me know your opinion on it. I'm going to go ahead and break it down a little bit for you. So, obviously he made a video called Why I Hate to be Asian and um, he originally posted it on Facebook. Now, a lot of his friends were giving him a lot of shit on Facebook and actually when he was responding to their hate, he was responding to it in like a douchebag way. I mean, if you've seen the video, you'll understand what I mean, like a frat boy douchebag kind of a way. So, you know, one of his friends on Facebook actually decided to take that video, upload it to YouTube, and then that's when it went viral. So, it says here, I have written down some of the things that he said about Asians, and I'm just going to respond to those. He said that he would not want to be Asian because most Asians look alike. Number one, all other races to a specific race look alike. Like to me, most white people look alike, most Asians look alike, most Indians look alike, even most Africans look alike, Europeans, and all, of them, all of them look alike. I mean, that's just the way it is. So to all white people, everybody else looks alike. That's the, that's the running stereotype of every single race. So you might as well just be your own race and just look completely different if you don't want to look like anybody else. Because to me, you honestly look like because uh, I know you're watching this, Sam Hendrickson. I know you're watching it. You look like every single white frat boy that I've ever seen. In fact, I was in a fraternity, so I know exactly what the hell I'm talking about. Second one that he said, these are just random things that I picked. Asians, <laughs> Asian pot smoking. Can you imagine how you looked high? It's called chink eye. Would it be called double chink eye? This is just even too stupid to comment on. I mean, of course, everybody's eyes get, uh, you know, low and they look uh, a little bit different because, you know, you're squinting and whatnot. But actually, from what I understand, the reason why Asians' eyes are not as large as a lot of the other races is because, this is from what I've heard, I can't fact check this, is that when uh, the humans were moving around about in the world in the early times, there were people that had to go through these gigantic deserts and obviously the um, the smaller your eye opening is the less sand that gets in your eyes so as time goes on and evolution happens if you believe in that that's why their eyes ended up getting that way so that in in <laughs> tied in with getting high the only thing that's going to happen is their eyes are going to get red has nothing to do with a per a, a so for me if I got high my eyelids would just get a little closed a little bit more so it won't even actually come close to looking like an Asian so that whole stereotype is completely wrong and uh, yeah so what the hell is he talking about then he said I don't want to be Asian because they all work in sweatshops <sighs> Can this kid get any more racist? I mean, what what was what was what did you think was going to happen when you say some shit like this? Yes, a lot of sweatshops are in the Asian cultures, but a lot of sweatshops are also in the Indian cultures and the African cultures and all those other things. But stereotypically, yes, Asian the Asian uh, like China and all that stuff are stereotyped for having the sweatshops. But to generalize and say that all Asians are in sweatshops is one of the stupidest things you could possibly do. It, that's just like, I, I, I just, I don't understand, I don't understand. That's like saying all Asians know martial arts, which I'm probably, he sh <sighs> man, I just, I'm so, I lost words, man. These people, when they do stuff like this, it just does not make sense. So, then, um... After it went viral, he decided that, hey, it's time for me to apologize. So he said to the poster, you know, hey, uh, can you please take that down? I'm sorry, blah, 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 you know, blah, 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 blah. Then he went to his Twitter and said, his, it says, I'm apparently hated by the whole Asian race over a joke, hashtag bummer. Apparently? 
when you say something that's stupid, just like that UCLA girl, she went off on Asians saying, oh, you know, they're always in the library, and yada, 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 you know, I don't want my library back, yet. and then she was just bombarded with tons and tons of hate, I, feel, I think she couldn't even go back to her school or anything like that, so, just, uh, and another one of his tweets says, I like to apologize to the Asian community for my video. It was a joke and I don't hate all Asians and I'm not racist. Hashtag yep. Uh, newsflash, dude, you're the one of the most ignorant racist people out there. You might as well just go and join the KKK if you're going to just say dumb shit like this on a regular basis. And as his tweets go on, it just gets more and more apologetic. The last one that I saw is, I'm honestly very, very sorry. I will take on your hate and words, but I would like you to know that I know what I did was wrong. Hashtag I'm sorry. Aww. You know what? That's like punching somebody in the face. That's why I can't stand when people say I'm sorry. It's like punching somebody in the face and be like, oh, dude, I'm so sorry. And then what is that supposed to do? Magically make your nose go back to normal? Magically make the blood stop? Magically make the pain stop? After you've been such a douchebag and you come and say stuff like this, it doesn't make any sense. So, yes, there are there stereotypes out there, and was he just playing on the stereotypes? Yes, he was. I mean, the movies go after stereotypes of black people, Indian people, white people, and black people talk about black people's stereotypes, and Asian people talk about Asian people's stereotypes, and we make comedy out of them, but to come out and blatantly say these things in a hateful mean way and f with the purpose of s of poking fun at a race um, to make yourself feel superior is completely racist man this is ridiculous dude I, I just I don't I don't get it man let me know in the comment section below what you guys think this video is way too long um peace out like subscribe uh